To use this tool, first select a single light, then click on the Place Highlight button. Next, left click on a polygon in the perspective view to immediately place the highlight or reflection at that position. This is achieved by moving the light with respect to the render camera. Holding left click whilst dragging the mouse, allows you to interactively move the light's reflection, across the mesh surface of all visible mesh items. And thanks to the way Moto works, you can change light selection without dropping the tool. Very handy. Alternatively, you can use right click to activate the tool without changing the light's position or facing. This is especially useful if you wish to change only the light's distance from the surface or to rotate its reflection. Use the rotate handle to spin the light around its facing, which spins its reflection. This can also be done by setting the spin value in the tool properties panel. Use the move handle to change the distance of the light from the surface. This can also be done by right click hauling or by setting the disk to surface value in the tool properties panel, which can be accessed using the Moto keyboard shortcut K. And that's how to use place highlight in Moto. For more detailed information about how to use this and other tools in the first light kit, visit the thirdguild.com.